What is up everybody, Scape211 here, and we got a bit of a different video for you today. I just got some gameplay in the background, but I wanted to talk about a few other things. I saw this posted on the official Mech Arena Facebook today, and I wanted to talk about it. It says, coming soon, battle event, complete all challenges to get special rewards. Now this looks really cool. Obviously new content is always fun, uh, but I wanted to speculate about what this could mean and what I think it means and then hear from you guys what you think it might mean. Uh, personally, I think it means they're going to be adding a new, probably regular event. Based on the square, it looks like this will go right next to tournament, like when you hit battle. Tournament right now, next to, uh, you know, your, your team play and then your quick play looks really big. I'm assuming they're going to size that down and fit this there, which is awesome. Um, and it's probably going to be similar to Loot Rush where it has a progress path on the top. And then as you complete regular challenges, probably similar to daily challenges, it'll fill up that bar and it'll give you resources, which is really cool. Um, that's my guess. I, I don't know if that's exactly what's going to be. Like I said, it's all speculation. My hope, though, is that this is going to be something related to CPC, like the, the match I'm doing here. Uh, just because, let's face it, honestly, there's not much value right now in CPC based gameplay yeah it gets you your regular crates it helps you with some um you know uh daily challenges that you have but tournament is really where it's been at that's where you get the key resources that's where you really get to focus on um getting the stuff you need to upgrade and do better in the game and it's a lot of a grind but i would love if cpc became more important um and i'm hoping this is a way that de the developers try to do that so Really interesting stuff. I'd love to hear your comments, like I said, about what you think this new uh, event could be. But for a lot of us, we think, okay, new content is great, but what about all the issues that we've been experiencing in game lately, right? Aren't those important or maybe even more important than adding new content? And I couldn't agree more. And uh, a lot of us feel like we haven't heard much from the devs on this stuff, but uh, I've been trying to comb around and see what I can find. Uh, and they've definitely had some various responses. And here is a good example of one. Uh, thanks to Ecot for sharing this with us. But he basically asked them, can we ever get rid of the AI and fix the matchmaking issues? Which is a great question, something I always think about, right? Um, and they said, you know, we're not going to get rid of AI. AI is always going to be there, which is understandable to me. Even some big games like Call of Duty Mobile likely have AI bots just in case they need to fill some gaps in player base. Um, but they have been working on the matchmaking system and seeing that it's more effective, but they can't really tell us about all the results until everything is worked out. But it sounds like they are working on matchmaking. And then, of course, they say when the game goes worldwide, the player base will grow and we'll see less AI, which is very true. And that's common of a lot of games, uh, which also makes me feel like they have a, a game for, I mean, a, an idea for what they want to do for launch once this hits global, which is great. So all that is very reassuring in my mind. They're working on matchmaking. That's all I really want to hear. I want to know that they see matchmaking is an issue and that they're working on it. And that's what it sounds like. So that is great. All right. So uh, next up, we want to talk about the hackers, right? Hackers is a huge issue. Said, uh, you know, uh, what are you guys doing about the hackers, right? See them all the time. And they say this issue is number one for our team and we will fix it as soon as we can, which again is great to hear. Obviously they have put some time into hackers because people have had their accounts banned and some stuff has been taken out of the game. I mean, players have been taken out of the game. So definitely they've done some immediate action, but it sounds like they're trying to do long-term work on this. Hackers happen in every game. So good that they're working on this. And then we have the other issue of the bots that are in the game. Hey, can we get rid of the stupid bots that are spamming in chat? Right, of course, they're super annoying. And the devs have said, yeah, we released a hot fix to mute part of the spammers, which is great. I know that they're still there, but hot fixes are, are always a, the quick thing they try and do. But it looks like they're going to be giving us maybe a permanent feature we can control where we can block certain people or certain bots. But in the meantime, don't engage with these people. Don't go to the website. Honestly, you're probably better off just direct messaging with your friends. That's all I do, and it should keep you safe. I hope this was all helpful to you guys. As always, if you want to comment below about it, please do. But otherwise, we'll see you out there on the battlefield.